Japanese like to take lessons. We want to cultivate our mind. We take lessons such as English conversation, piano, ballet, uh, cooking, painting, reading poetry, singing, and so on. Well, the situation was almost the same in the Edo era. Uh, there were many schools where people learned various subjects. What do you think? Even preparing and drinking tea can be a good subject to learn. It has reached the level of philosophy enjoyed and learned by many people in the world. It seems anything can be a good subject to learn if you have some space, a good reason to learn, and a convincing teacher. It was possible to start a lesson. Seiyan! Seiyan! Kiko, what do you want? Well, I want you to come to one place with me. Where do you want to take me? Well, I want you to come to a lesson with me. Lesson. <sighs> Give me a break. I'm sick of seeing you taking lessons. Do you remember the first time you took me to a lesson? You took me to a dancing lesson. <laughs> well, the first day was so easy. The teacher wanted you to dance to a very simple and popular piece of music called Yakkos, and anybody could do it, but you couldn't do it. You were such a clumsy dancer. When you started dancing, everybody started to laugh. And the teacher stared at me with an angry face. It seemed as if she was saying, why in the world did you bring such a terrible man? <laughs> I felt so embarrassed and I ran away. <laughs> I quit that lesson. Of course you should. You should quit that. Well, then you took me to the second lesson. The second lesson was a shamisen lesson. The first day was so easy. The teacher wanted you to make the three basic sounds of shamisen. Chin, tong, shan, chin, tong, shan. It's easy. Children could do it, but you couldn't do it. <laughs> the teacher told you to pick one string at a time, but you always picked two or three strings at the same time and sounded like jan, 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 the same tone. The, the teacher kept saying one string at a time, one string at a time, but you always did jan, 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 jan. The teacher easily got tired and angry. I was so embarrassed. <laughs> Say, and I quit that lesson too. Then you took me to the third lesson. The third lesson was a Joruri lesson, you know, storytelling of Bunraku theater. The first day was so easy, the teacher told you to read one simple and popular phrase. But you couldn't do it, right? It was so easy, but you couldn't do it. You were so excited, but you never listened to the teacher. The teacher easily gave up teaching you, but you were still shouting so loudly. You know what happened after that? A police officer came in. <laughs> the police officer said he had such an unusually loud shouting that he thought something bad must have happened. What kind of voice do you have? <laughs> Say, I quit that lesson too. <laughs> then you said you are going to take a judo lesson. <laughs> well, I didn't want to get hurt, so I didn't go to the gym. But a few days later, when I saw you on the bridge, I asked you if you were still taking judo lessons. You mysteriously smiled and suddenly said that you would throw a gangster-looking man who was coming toward us. I said, no, no, you shouldn't do it, but you had already dashed toward him. Then I heard the splash on the water. I felt sorry for the man who was thrown into the river, but when I looked at the man, he was standing there. <laughs> then I heard your voice from the water, help! <laughs> Well, I had to go to the man and I apologized to him. I had to explain how stupid my friend was. And I had to ask someone to take you out of the water. <laughs> See, and I quit that lesson too. Kiko, you are never suitable for any lessons. You shouldn't take any lessons. I don't want to be bothered. I don't want to come with you. Hey, say, young, my friend, please come with me. This is going to be the last one. There won't be the next one. Well. What do you want this time? Well, I want to learn yawning. What? I want to learn yawning. What is yawning? Say, um, don't you know yawns? The only yawns I know is something that comes out of your mouth when you are sleepy or tired or bored. That's right. I'm going to learn that. Are you going to learn yawning? Well, there's only one good thing about you. Your parents died a long time ago. 
If they were alive now, they would be really sad to know their sons learning yawning. <laughs> hey, yawns come out naturally. Why do you have to take lessons? But, but there's this guy who says he wants to get money by teaching yawning. There must be a special type of yawning. I want to learn that. Hey, hey, hey there's a school over there. Can you see the sign over there? Sign? Uh, oh, yeah. It says, a yawning gym. <laughs> I'm surprised. I'm impressed. There are so many kinds of jobs. Okay, you can go ahead, take lessons. I'm not going. Come on, say. And when I'm alone, I get really nervous and tense, and I can't concentrate on my lesson. Please come with me. Okay, okay. I will just go in. But as soon as you start taking lessons, I will go away. Okay, that's okay. Just come with me. Come with me. Uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yes. Who is it? Well, I'm interested in yawning. I want to learn it. Oh, you want to learn yawning. You are the first student. <laughs> oh, you are such a young man, but you are interested in this quiet and modest art. That's really good. Mm. Oh, does your friend also want to learn yawning? No, no, he just accompanied me. He wants to see the lesson. Okay, okay, you can sit over there. Mister, come here, sit in front of me. Okay, okay. Uh, by the way, Master, about yawns you teach, are they something that come out when you are sleepy or bored? Mm -hmm. You are talking about what we call wasted yawns. Dakubi. Dakubi. Really. Uh, are there many other types of good yawns? Yes. There are many types of good yawns. I categorize them into three levels, beginning, intermediate, and advanced. There are many types of yawns, depending on the season and the occasion. For example, there are yawns for New Year, yawns for Midsummer Days, yawns for wedding ceremonies, yawns for funeral services, yawns for reading poetry, yawns for going fishing. Wow! There are so many. Well, could you tell me about one specific type of yawn? Well, for a beginner like you, how about late night bath yawn? Late night bath yawn. What kind of yawn is that? Well, imagine this situation. You are such a hard worker. You work until late at night. When you get home, all your family members have already taken a bath. You are the only person, you are the last person to take a bath. There's some heat left in the burner, but you don't want to ask your wife to add more firewood. You want to save energy. So, the water temperature is not so hot. You settle for this not-so-hot water. But in terms of health, it's really good to take a bath like that. When you soak your body in the water, your body slowly warms up. The fatigue of the day is slowly released. When you look out the window, you can see the beautiful full moon in the lonely night sky. You are enchanted by the beauty of this full moon. You feel so relaxed. Naturally, oh, 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 this is a late night bus. <laughs> good, good, good. That's really good. But uh, I want to learn something, something more interesting. Interesting. Well, how about lonesome cherry blossom viewing the home? <laughs> One sunny spring day, you go to see cherry blossoms. Other people are having fun, making much noise, dancing and singing under cherry trees. But you are alone. They quietly enjoying the beauty of the blossoms in full bloom. You are drinking some sake and wondering why other people can't enjoy the beauty more quietly. You are fascinated by the pinkish white blossoms in full bloom. Slight smell of the blossoms is so perfect. You feel so relaxed, naturally. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this is a lonesome cherry blossom viewing yawn. How about midsummer beach yawn? One sunny summer day, you are walking along the beach, looking at the horizon. 
You feel as if you are a bird flying over the beach. You are fascinated by the beauty of the blue sky and the quiet water. You feel as if you are assimilated in the summer breeze. You feel so relaxed, naturally. Oh, 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 oh. This is a midsummer beach yawn. <laughs> Wow, this is good. This is really good. Well, but, you know, I'm crazy about playing shogi, you know, Japanese chess. Is there any type of yon for playing Japanese chess? Well, there is. Yes. But it's uh, quite uh, advanced. You might find it a bit too difficult. But as you are the first student of the stream, I will teach you the yon for playing shogi specially for you. Good, 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 good. Okay, how does it go? Well, when you play shogi, you sometimes have to wait until your friend moves one of his pieces. You sometimes have to wait a long time, and it happens quite frequently. When you look at your friend's face, he is thinking really seriously. He makes you wait for one minute, two minutes, three minutes, sometimes five minutes. You think you have already won the game. Your friend has no chance. It's obvious. Well, you decide to light up your tobacco. <sighs> Do I have to wait more? It's obvious. I have already won the game. It's okay to play shogi sometimes, but as he makes me wait for so long, I'm bored. I'm bored. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> good, 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 good. I want to do it. I want to do it. Let me do it. Okay, so I should light up my tobacco, right? Okay, okay. Good, good, good. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> you are so restless. <laughs> you need to relax. You can't yawn that way. You should take one uh, short and light bath. Okay, okay, okay. Let me do that. Let me do that. Okay, okay. Now. <laughs> well, mm, it's obvious. I have already won the game. Uh, do I have to wait more? It's, it's okay to play shogi sometimes, but as he makes me wait for so long, I'm bored. I'm bored. I'm. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Why do you sneeze? You should yawn, okay? Oh. I'm sorry, I have hay fever. Okay, yeah, let me try, let me try. Let me try one more time. Please give me another chance. I can do it, I can do it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> mm, do I have to wait more? I have already won the game. It's obvious. It's okay to play shogi sometimes, but as he makes me wait for so long, I'm bored. I'm bored. I'm bored. Ha, ha, ha. That's not yawn. <laughs> Yawning comes from Zen Buddhism. It is partly related to tea ceremony too. You need a peaceful mind. You can't achieve anything if you are restless like that, okay? Do just like this. Take a light and a short puff, okay? Do I have to wait more? I have already won the game. It's okay to play shogi sometimes, but as he makes me wait for so long, I'm bored. I'm bored. Oh, oh, oh! What in the world are they doing? How can they be serious about learning this kind of things? There are so many people working outdoors. I know my friend Kiko is a stupid guy, but that teacher is even worse. <laughs> what did he say? He said, yawning comes from Zen Buddhism. <laughs> Zen Buddhists would be angry to hear that. <laughs> Well, they may be happy teaching and learning what they like, but what about me? Waiting while this is going on. It's okay to take lessons sometimes, but as they make me wait for so long, I'm bored. I'm bored. Oh, oh, oh. oh. mister, your friend is a real yawning master. 